Today I'm going to show you a money wash script created by this person. Players interact with an NPC to wash or exchange the dirty money they get. What's really cool are the tax options. You can have it as a set rate or make it change every so often, which is customizable as well. I'll leave a link to the resource in the description. I hope you enjoy the video. First, click the link in the description that takes you to the resource. You can scroll and check out the features, dependencies, and an install guide with a link to the documentation. So I'll go back up and download it. Once it's done, open it up and open your server resources and add it in. I'm putting it in a folder that's already insured, so make sure it's starting after the dependencies. And once you have it in, just make sure you move the extra numbers from the end. Once that's done, the next thing to look at is the config. So go to the resource folder and open the config. The first section deals with the language, the notification option, and a version check. There's also commented out text that explains the options. Then there are options for the blip. You can enable it or disable it and change the settings for it. If you want to change the sprite and color, you go to the site using the link provided. Pick the sprite and color you like and simply replace the numbers here. Next is location of the ped and the model. If you want to change the model as similar to the blips, you just go to the site using the link, of course. And once you find one you like, copy it and replace it with the name here. Next are options for washing. For the currency, you can put an item or the dirty money you use. So I'm going to change it to marked bills. Then you have the tax rate and options to use dynamic tax and the settings for that. You can use one or the other. It's also explained in the commented out text. Next is the time it takes to wash in seconds and the minimum and maximum amounts that can be washed at a time. And the last thing will be the player cooldown, which is in minutes. The next section is for the teleport, which is how you get in and out of the building the pet is in. You can enable it or disable it and move the location, of course, by changing the cords. Then there's an option for the webhook, which are logs. You can disable it if you want. To set it up, you need to enter the webhook URL here, which I can show using Discord. So I'll go there and create a new channel. I'm just going to call it Money Wash. Oops, I can spell. Then once you have the channel, go to Edit Channel down to integrations, and then create webhook. Once it's created, click it and do copy webhook URL, and go back to the config and paste what you copied. The last thing is the debug. It's already false, so no changes need to be made. You can enable it for testing. Be sure to save everything you change, then start your server and test it out. I'm at the location now, and here's the blip on the map. So I'll go ahead and go in and go to the ped. And once you interact, it shows you the marked bills you have in your inventory, as well as the worth. If you don't have any, it'll just be a blank menu, so I'll go ahead and drop these for now. How's it going? And as you can see, nothing's there. How's it going? And when you go to exchange, it'll tell you how much you'll receive after the tax cut. So go ahead and confirm. and let you know how much cash you got and that it was successful. Now there is a cooldown, so if I try it again, it won't let me. And that'll be all for this video. If you enjoyed it and it helped you out, please leave a like and a sub. If you need help or have any suggestions, feel free to comment down below or join my Discord. The link will be in the description. Thank you for watching.